Yo, how's it going guys? Welcome back to my channel. Hope you are doing well and welcome to a Pokemon pack opening video. Now today, what I'm going to be doing is opening up some of these Pokeballs. I just couldn't resist them. I had to open them because if you guys know, there are evolution packs inside of here and we are Charizard hunting. I said this was going to be the last time I opened these balls for a while, but you know what? I just couldn't resist. I had to get some more because I want to hunt for that evolution Charizard and hopefully we can pull it today. So if you do enjoy this video, do give it a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe and join the Charizard gang. I'm giving away a double pack, Darkness Ablaze Blister Pack. These are so hard to get your hands on now. So if you do want to get involved with that, Make sure you hit 100 likes on this video and at the end of the month I'll be giving away one of these to you guys so be sure to enter that but what we're going to be doing is opening those packs as well as Pokeballs. So we have three chances to pull a Charizard in today's video. We have the Darkness Ablaze pack, we have the Burning Shadows in this ball as well as the Evolutions. Hopefully we can hit home run and if we do that would be worth crazy money if they're all in PSA 10 so this is probably technically an expensive pack opening but guys last thing before we jump into it if you do want to help support me and the channel be sure to become a member click the join button down below or check the description box it helps me out massively and everything goes straight back into the channel so be sure to check it out there are certain tiers hopefully that accommodate for all type of people so let's get into it and let's see if we can pull these charizards so we have the two pokeball tins right here and we have the darkness ablaze and rebel clash uh, double pack blister so what we're going to do is we're just going to crack into them but look how look how weird that is by the way look how crimpled that pokemon is right there it's like put pimon it literally just says pimon but i want to set you guys a comment section challenge and that is to guess which pokeball is going to have the better pulls is it going to be the great ball or is it going to be the pokeball let me know down below um and we'll just you know what well, i'll set the packs aside so we know which ball's which but yeah let me know in the comment section is the great ball gonna win or is the pokeball gonna win so let's find out so we'll crack this open i can't believe how weirdly this is wrapped it looks so strange but these also make really really good uh, display like pieces as well you could just have them in your background and they look really cool to be fair so shout out to pokemon for making these i, I really like them and uh soon i think i can't remember if it's out in february they're actually doing series six these are series five balls um so it'll be interesting to see what uh ball design they do and then also what packs they decide to put inside them as well so i wonder if there's going to be evolutions in because i have a feeling just after looking at like collection boxes now, it, it seems like the Pokemon or Nintendo are putting less po uh, evolution uh, packs in these things, in collection boxes and Pokeball tins. So, you know what? I kind of feel like they're, they're trying to take them out of like boxes, which means they're going to be even rarer. So, inside here, we have the three packs. We also have a Raichu uh, coin, which is really cool looking. I really like those coins. Uh, and if you guys... Actually, what's your opinion on those coins? Let me know down below. And uh, if you ever guys want them for a giveaway or something, uh, be sure to let me know. And there is uh, the Great Ball. So, I have a feeling it's the same, the same coin. Yep, right there, as you guys can see. So, I'll put that to the side. So, here is the way we're going to do it. We're going to... We've got Pokeball, Ultra Ball, Darkness Ablaze, and Rebel Clash. We are ready to rock, guys. We are absolutely ready to rock. We're going to start off with the Rebel Clash. Uh, we've got Inteleon or Cinderace, and let's just get straight into it. If you do enjoy this video, guys, like I said, be sure to smash a like button on the video. It helps out massively, and if you hit 100 likes, I'll be giving away one of these double pack blisters to you guys. So, for to the front, I'm going to guess, you know what, I'm going to zoom in a little bit for you guys, so we can get these. I might actually move these packs a little bit, just so, uh, just so we have a bit more emphasis on the old... Um, the cards but here we go i'm gonna guess metal water energy okay can we get that first pack luck we get a phalanx palpitoad capture energy snova looking at a footprint p dove darumaka hatena scyther look how cool that artwork is you know what i'm zooming a little bit more as well uh we then have a reverse hollow zatu as Leon Hart would say, Zatu, how'd you do? Oh no, it's Natu, isn't it? This is the Revolve form. This is the Evolve form. And then the final card is a Aegislash, Slash, who I can never say right, but it's just a regular rare. Okay. First pack, a little bit dead, but we never get that first pack luck. You guys know the deal by now. Next up, we have a Rebel Clash pack with Cinderace. Now, if we can get a Rainbow Rare Boss's Orders, we're in, we're in for it, because that is probably one of the better cards in the set. 
Uh, one, two, three, four. And I just remembered actually, someone, I'm going to guess, uh, let's go for Leaf. Someone uh, commented down below saying to hide the code card. So I'm actually going to do that and then show it at the end of the uh, the video. Uh, we get a Dan, Carco, because it kind of ruins the surprise a lot of people saying. Shinx, Roly Coley, Applin, Hatena, Magikarp with the chubby cheeks Pikachu. We then get a Binnacle or Binnacle. And the final card is a Zacian. Hey, we'll take that or Zacian. Let me know how you pronounce it. Zacian or Zacian. Um, I like this card. Unfortunately, it's just a holographic. I'd love to it uh, for it to be a. Uh, it's a non-holographic. I prefer it to be a holographic, but unfortunately, it's not. Anyway, moving on. Darkness ablaze. Now we have two darkness ablaze packs, both center scorch on the front. Can we get something good? And um, like I mentioned in yesterday's video, guys, if you haven't checked it out, I talk about uh, Logan Paul. I talk about a record. Oh, I nearly showed it. Uh, a record breaking. Um, three four. Uh, sale of a first edition base set booster box this go psychic and um, I also talk about just the state of Pokemon and Pokemon cards at the moment it's really difficult to get a uh, hands-on product that's why there haven't been that many um, Pokemon pack opens on my channel at the moment just because there's I can't get my hands on anything so if uh, they do slow up on the Pokemon pack openings I do apologize we get a reverse holo combustion very cool and the final card is a Mel Metal. So, so far, we haven't got a pool yet. We haven't got a big pool. Some cool cards, just nothing nothing special, you know? Um, but there will be many, many more. Obviously, this is the, the predominant videos on this channel are going to be pack openings because it's my favorite thing to do. I just can't get my hands on anything at the moment. So, uh, let me move the card. Uh, so, yeah, th there will be more in the future. When Shining Fates comes out, I'm going to be opening loads of that. Just, it is so hard to get my hands on anything. Okay, final pack of Darkness of Blaze. I'm going to go Water Energy. Lightning, back to back. Okay. Vibrava. Gothita. Oh, Gotharita, sorry. Pokemon Breeding Nurturing. Kufant. Sinisty. We get a Feebas. Passamian. Fletchling. A Reverse Hollow Toxel. I love Toxel. And the final card is a Wigglytuff Regular Rare. All right. So... They absolutely didn't give out for once. They usually do, to be fair. We usually got some mad pulls. But anyway, moving on to the challenge for you guys. We have Pokeball versus Ultra Ball. Uh, no, Great Ball, sorry. We're going to start off with the Pokeball first. Let me know in the comment section which ball you think is going to have the better pulls. And we'll do it one by one. So we'll do the Pokeball and then the uh, Great Ball. And then we'll go to the second pack of the Pokeball. Nearly gave the code card away then. One, two, three, four. Um, and then we'll just go back and forth like that. Okay, so first pull for the Pokeball. Crimson Invasion. I'm going to go Metal. Fire. Okay. Look how cool that Fire Energy looks. From Crimson Invasion. We get Al Alolan Graveler. Very cool looking. We get a Laron. We get a Gla uh, Gladion. Or Gladion. Starly. Nummel. Chimeko, we get a Bunnelby, a Carablast, a Reverse Holo Reggie Ice. That's very cool. A, re uh, a, re a Reverse Holo uh, ho uh, Rare. That's really, really cool. Finally got there in the end. And then the final card of the first pack is... Ooh, we get a Holographic Xerneas. Look at that. That card looks cool as hell. Two big pulls in that pack. So that is a very strong pack there from Crimson Invasion. Very, very decent. Let's see uh, if the, ult the, the... I keep calling it the Ultra Ball. It's the Great Ball. Let's see if the Great Ball can uh, return and come back with its with its own heat. Okay. Pack's opened. I'm going to hide the code so you guys can't see it. One, two, three, four. Let's go for Water Energy. Hey, we guessed it right. Okay. Is this going to be... Is this going to bring the luck? Dash in Pouch. Yeah, I'll definitely rep that. We get a Kakuna Matata, uh, Staravia, Mankey, Jam. Is it Jang Mu or Jang Moo? We then get a Carablast, a Feebas, a Salandit. Ooh, a Reverse Hollow Mill Tank, just chilling by a tree. Really cool. And the final card is a uh, Star Staraptor. So unfortunately, for the Great Ball, it's one nil to the Pokeball. Okay. One hit from the Pokeball. Moving on now to Burning Shadows. We have... Um, is that uh, ne Necrozma on the front, I believe? 
Let's get into it. Hide the code card. One, two, three, four. I'm going to guess, uh, let's go for metal. Water, okay. We get a Viper. Rotom deck, uh, escape rope. Riolu, I love that artwork, that looks sick. Alolan Grimer. Ladybug. Cutie Fly. Horsey. A reverse holo Passamian. Really cool. And the final card is a Weevil regular rare. Okay, so the Pokeball doesn't go two for two, unfortunately for it. Moving on to the Great Ball. With the Burning Shadows, remember there is a chance to get a Charizard in here. Please, can I pull it? I haven't pulled it before and I'd absolutely love to. And if any ball gets the Charizard, it's an instant win. You know the rules by now. So there's the code card over there. One, two, three, four. Uh, let's go for... Let's go for uh, Lightning. Oh, you know what? You know I hesitated for so long. I was going to say Fire. Oh, man. Okay, here we go. Uh, bodybuilding Dumbles. Uh, Ace Arola. Dusclops. Porygon doing the Kamehameha. Sork. Oddish, just chilling. Oh, we get a Charmander and a fire energy. Is that a sign? I love this Charmander. He just looks like... He reminds me of the one in the anime, you know, who's waiting for his trainer. Shout out if you know what I'm, uh, what I'm talking about. Then we get a Marrow, a Reverse Hollow Rolts, and the final card is a regular rare Scollipede. Okay, no pull on that one for either ball. So it is down to... The two evolutions packs. Guys, let me know. Pokeball or Great Ball. Hit a like on this video. I need your luck right now. We haven't had big pulls today. So I need you guys to smash that like button. Every like helps me out with the luck. Okay. So anyway, Pokeball up first. Both Blastoise packs as well, by the way. Interesting. I'll open it up. I absolutely love evolutions. It's, it's getting harder and harder to find these packs, honestly. These are rare, rare packs nowadays. We're going to hide the code card. One, two, three. Oh, it's three this time. I nearly did four. There's no guess the energy with evolutions, so we're just going to get straight into it. Kakuna Matata. Full heal. You know what? We're split screening it. We're split screening it. Machoke. Growlithe, we get a Machop, Voltorb, Diglett, Caterpie, a Reverse Hollow Onyx, and the final card of the Pokeball tin is a Holographic Zapdos, let's go, we get a Hollow Zapdos, or Zapdos depending on how you pronounce it. That card is beautiful. Look at that. Yo, I will take that. I will definitely take that. Let's leave this bad boy up. Absolutely love Zapdos. I think this is one of the coolest Zapdo uh, Zapdos artworks there is, to be fair. Let me sleeve that up before we check the centering on it. But guys, look how beautiful this card looks. Absolutely stunning. The centering's not too bad. It's a little bit thick on the, uh, on the left. There's a bit of a ding on the left as well. Which is the only annoying thing from getting these packs from Pokeballs is that they don't, they, they kind of feel like they're not kept in the best of condition. But we do get a big pull. We get a big, big pull in Zapdos Holographic. We'll take it. And now we're moving on to the Great Ball. Can it compete with that? So far, I think the Pokeball's got two hits, to be fair, as well. So I think we just need a Charizard um, to see if it beats it. But anyway, we're going split screen again. One, two, three. And let's get it. Here we go. We get a Charmeleon. Is that a sign? I'm literally just looking at the center and it's a little bit off. We get a double colorless energy. De uh, Deep Evolution Spray. Vulpix. Sandshrew. Onyx. Magikarp. Energy. A reverse hollow energy. Will this be electrifying? The last card of today's video is a regular rare Radicate. So we don't end on a bang. We do get a reverse holo energy though. And today's big pull is this beautiful Zapdos 
from Evolutions. Look how amazing that artwork is. It just stands out. It looks electrifying and it's just a beautiful, beautiful card. Oh, actually, also, there are the code cards for you guys if you want to try and get your hands on that. That is going to wrap up today's video. Shout out to everyone who put the Pokeball in the comment section challenge. Also, big, big thank you to everyone who smashed that like button. Remember, there is a giveaway if this video hits 100 likes. And be sure to subscribe and join the Charizard gang. And be sure to check out the memberships down below by clicking that join button. Remember, if you do decide to become a member, thank Thank you so much it helps me out massively and everything goes back to the channel for you guys so be sure to check it out but yeah that is going to wrap up this video guys hopefully you have enjoyed it i will see you in the next one but until then i am out